my people and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be one that is kind of a follow-up of one that I did a couple of videos back, maybe like four videos or something back, um, and that was my favorite everyday lip products. I thought that, you know what, for even for everyday basis, I do like to wear statement um, lipsticks. And currently, I decided to share with you my top five favorite statement lipsticks. So if you'd like to see what they are, then definitely keep on watching. first one that I would like to tell you about is my current favorite lipstick formula and a fantastic lip color, which is the Estee Lauder Pure Color Envy in the shade Insolent Plum 450, which looks like this. It's just so beautiful. If you like, um, what's that one called? MAC Rebel, then this is like a 10 times better Rebel for you. It's just so beautiful. I will swatch it on my hands just for you to see. Ah! I sound like a disaster. But this is what the color looks like. Absolutely, hands down, beautiful. Next we have a um, a color that I would classify as an orange red. It's red, but it's orange. It's beautiful. It's bold. It's very, you know, look at me. I'm here and I'm here to stay. And it's the Tom Ford Lipstick in Wild Ginger, number 15. Yes, you can't see the TF anymore because that's, that's as much as I used it. I love it. It's just so nice. And I'll show you the swatch. It's like so pretty on the lips, like with like very simple makeup. This can be your ultimate everyday, you know what, I'm here and I don't care what lipstick I should wear on a daily basis, but I'm wearing this. This. Look at this. It's absolutely 100%, 1 billion percent divine. And the formula of this is rather nice. It's not my favorite formula formula of lipsticks, but it's definitely, definitely a good one to um, try. Next we have the one that I was intimidated by at first, but when I wore it for the first time, I was like, you know, smiling at, my, at myself, you know what, <gasps> I look very, very scary and almost gothic, but I love it. It smacks smoke purple. It's a matte formula, but it's just, it's so matte that it should be like a retro matte because it's just that matte. And it is kind of talking on the lips, but it's so beautiful nonetheless. It's this, this is it. And another one that I like as much as I love this, and it gives me that same effect, is Rimmel Kate Moss in the shade number 04. Yes, it's like, it's the, it gives the same effect. It's almost the same color, but it's more glossy. That one is completely matte and this one is glossy. It's so beautiful. Can you see how like they go perfectly together? If you want to give your smoke profile just a little bit of dimensions and glossiness, this is the perfect one to put on top of smoke purple if you don't want it to look as matte as it clearly is. It's so nice, so beautiful. I love it. I can't recommend it enough. And if you can buy this and if you can find this, because unfortunately, there's no longer Rimmel in Israel. Rimmel has departed. It has left us crying. And then the last one that I have to share with you today is the fantastic YSL Glossy Stain. I love the range in general, and this one is like my favorite go-to red. And it's in the shade number 9. I think it was called something like Rouge Lac. And it looks like this. It needs to be built up, built up a little bit. But it's so pretty. Let me just show you. This is it right here. It's so beautiful. I love it. I love the longevity of it. I love the glossiness. Even the glossiness lasts for a very long time. This formula of lipsticks used to be talked about quite a lot, maybe two years ago. And I'm still hooked on it. I love it. It should never be discontinued. This formula of lipsticks YSL 
don't discontinue this ever 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 because it's absolutely 100% divine that's all I'm gonna say on this topic these are my top five bold statement lip picks and I hope that you like them if you have any lipstick that you would like to tell me about that you think I will absolutely love leave it in the comments bar down below and let me know what you thought of my picks in the, comments bar, no, in the comments bar down below. I shall see you in the next one. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. And of course, comment as I already told you to do. And I shall see you in the next video. Bye.